you're visiting a typical American housewife, the proud owner of a new Studebaker Lark. Mrs. Uh, yes. But you're Zsa Zsa Gabor. Oh, that's one of my names. But we're supposed to interview a new Lark owner. But I'm the new Lark owner. You want to see my lovely new car? It's right there in the driveway. Uh, of course. Oh, the Lark styling, Miss Gabor. How do you like it? Well, frankly, I'm practically always frank. At first, I thought it's too big, it's too high. But then I found out why they raised the roof. I can get in. And out without losing my head. I can jump in. And out for shopping. You do your marketing like that, Miss Gabor? Of course, darling. Nobody dresses around here. At night, with the new high hairdo, it's so easy to get in. And this cow, it's so nice, so chic. And how do you like our built-in vanity case? This is a great idea. And the car's performance, Miss Gabor? <laughs> oh, it's divine. And I don't know the words they do. Oh, those brakes. Disc brakes? The clever thing. How did you know? Well, my friend says I would be in jail from coast to coast if I wouldn't have them. And you know, after a little togetherness with the garage door, a whole new fender only costs twelve dollars. Because the fenders bolt on. And with these flat floors, you can't break your heels or get your new shoes wet. What's best about your lark, Miss Gabor? Well, it's not too big, it's not too small, it's completely different. And I like things different. Were you paid to say these things, Miss Gabor? Are you crazy? Of course, yes. I got a car in every color for every day of the week. And I love them. 